Hello again. Uh, my name's Emily, and this is just an update on um, my week two of being on the weight loss drug Contrate. Um, so if you didn't see my first video, um, you should check it out. <laughs> There's a bunch of backstory and reasons why I started and, and all that jazz. Um, this video is pretty much just going over um, how my first week went, the side effects, um, if I feel like it's working, that kind of thing. So in, in video, in the first video I did, um, the, I had taken it a couple hours prior to recording the video and, um, I felt fine, <laughs> but that changed. I felt like shit. I felt really, really bad. Um, I didn't throw up or anything, but I felt really nauseous and I passed out upstairs. Um, I, I took a nap for like, it was a good like three hour nap and it was in and out of sleep and really, really nauseous, didn't want to move, like, and then it kind of faded. And then day two was similar. Um, nausea wasn't as bad. Still really tired, like exhausted. I felt exhausted. Um, yeah, so with that, um, I also kind of felt like, I don't know, like not quite heart palpitations, but like I felt my heart beat, I, I don't know, like in my head, I thought my blood pressure was high. I checked my blood pressure, it was fine. But um, yeah, I just had this weird feeling like in my head and I could feel it in my shoulders and it felt like my heartbeat, like it, I don't know like an echo of my heartbeat here. I don't know if that makes any sense, but, um, and that lasted for a couple days. Um, I didn't have any like shortness of breath or anything that would indicate an issue or headache or anything like that. It just felt weird. Just felt weird. Um, I, I'm a nurse. I don't know. If, I mean, I, I mentioned that in the last video, so it's like, I mean, I've got the tools of my trade at home, so I checked it regularly. I checked my blood pressure. I checked, um, you know, my heart rate and my <clears throat> my oxygen, making th making sure things were good. Um, I think part of it was I was coming off of um, Effexor when I was getting on to the Contrave, so I think I'm having, or I was having a little bit of, like, withdrawal from that in addition to starting this new thing so that was that's my take on it um, I was really not in a nice mood <laughs> I'm kind of irritable again that could have been that I was also um, PMSing a little bit I started my period not long after that so that might have been it too um, anyway day three of one pill in the morning I felt a little bit better. Four was fine. I felt like normal again. I still kind of sometimes had, or still do kind of still have, a, like it makes me a little bit sleepy. Um, but my sleeping like pattern has changed in the past couple weeks. So that could be it too. So, um, so I went a little bit longer on the one pill. Um, than it was recommended just to, I don't know, I just felt better taking it a, a couple days longer, just the one pill before starting the second pill. Um, so I started taking my one in the morning and one in the evening. This is my third day, so two days ago. Um, the first day, I honestly I didn't have any like crazy side effects. I was just more sleepy, I felt like, which is odd to me, but whatever. Um, yeah, it hasn't really been a really big issue or a really big change. Um, I think I could probably stay on this for a week and then move up, like it like it suggests. But um, yeah, not a big change. Um, my only thing that I've noticed when taking this new medication is I take um, 
a lot of like not a lot but well uh, kind of a lot of like um like supplements like um like a multivitamin i take a joint supplement because of my joints um after covid they, they started really bugging me so i take that and i take a fish oil and those kinds of stuff things those kinds of things and um i've noticed that i well for one i didn't want to take it all together because i didn't know how it was going to affect me um so i tried a couple days of like you know i'll take that um i'll take the country first after i eat my breakfast and then wait like an hour and then take you know the rest of my stuff that didn't work really well for me that i that i didn't feel great i didn't feel tip top after doing that um so the next day i tried um taking spreading it out a little bit and it still really didn't do well for me um, and then the next day I tried taking like my multivitamin and stuff before right before my breakfast because that'll give me that'll make me a little nauseous if I don't eat with that um, right before my breakfast eat my breakfast have my coffee wait like a half an hour and then take the contrate and it doesn't seem to affect me like it did doing it other ways so I stuck with that Oops. I've stuck with that and um, I feel okay on it and sometimes I'll skip a day of like my multivitamins and stuff um, but it really hasn't had an issue. Like, it hasn't been an issue. Yeah, so that's been my, my big, I guess, side effects would be, like, a little bit of nausea, and it's making me sleepy. So, um, I haven't noticed any weight loss. Diet really hasn't changed that much. We've just gone through 4th of July, so... So yeah, the sleepiness has kind of been an issue, but I haven't, my, my um, appetite hasn't really, I've noticed a, a change in my appetite today, like, maybe like wanting a snack for lunch instead of like a whole lunch, you know, um, but yeah, again, I haven't really noticed any weight loss because we've been, 4th of July is going on right now, actually it is the 4th of July today. So we've been doing, you know, yesterday and had cookouts and things like that. So anyway, I just wanted to give an update. Um, I'll probably give an update when I go to three pills a day if I decide to do that. Maybe two will work for me. I don't know. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching if you watched. Um, if you're totally confused, again, check out my first video. And yeah, y'all take care. Bye.